everybody and welcome back to my youtube channel today i am so excited because we're gonna be cleaning up my room and my bookshelf so this is kind of a before of my very very messy room but i plan to kind of put my bookshelf right along here i am not sure if it's gonna fit but we're gonna be trying trying to but um of course i'm just gonna be doing some vacuuming first because my room is always so dusty so messy so that's that and of course decluttering my bookshelf in order to actually move it there so i honestly love to um decorate my bookshelf with all different random things like this bookmark little holder um this little kazawa plushie and just like really random stuff that don't doesn't really belong there but i like i like it i don't know it just it just adds some something to my bookshelf i feel like Okay, and now with that done, of course, we're gonna have to take all of my books off my huge bookshelf. Um, I'm just gonna be taking my manga off. I don't have a big collection, but I definitely wanna try and actually increase it. But of course, just taking everything off my shelf. This actually took a really long time because I like to take really good care of my books and kind of organize them a little bit into really neat little piles, um, you know, kind of by genre, I guess, or at least by sort of like trilogy, duology, standalones. That's kind of usually how I like to organize my books. But um, yeah, I have a lot of different fantasy books, as you can see, and I, yeah, I need more space. So we're gonna just be reorganizing this a little bit and hopefully I'll be able to literally have all of my books in one place because I'm actually gonna be, of course, yeah, organizing my room and my books need a place to kind of chill out in the corner or else I'm gonna be having to like move my whole room around them. So yeah, these are my little cute piles of my books. Okay, so of course the bookshelf is now empty, which it looks so nice, so clean, so white, and it just looks amazing. But of course, we're gonna be trying to move it, move my bookshelf literally across my whole room. And this, I've actually done this before in my room before um, where I actually like kind of put my bookshelf on its side so I can line books along it. But I've kind of realized that I never do it right. <laughs> like I just can't seem to have a good gauge of like, distance for some reason so i'm having to like push it back so i can actually put it down lest it literally scrape off my holes um but i finally was able to do it um very carefully be very careful whenever you're moving furniture by the way i am a trained trained furniture mover so <laughs> make sure you just be careful so yeah this is kind of what i mean by it being this way and i kind of well, this is kind of the reason why I'm like literally reorganizing my whole bookshelf in the sense like I'm literally changing its orientation. And for me, I think it's just such a fresh idea, just like a fresh little cool. Oh, yeah, that's Kitty. I love Kitty. She's so cute. Um, But yeah, I think it's really, really cool just to kind of change up your bookshelf, change it up. And this is kind of like what I wanted to go for in terms of like having my books very close to my bed so when i was talking about measurements like before i wanted to make sure that my my actual bed could fit next to this bookshelf so i'm going to be measuring right now you know measuring the measurements of course um i am not a engineer student i i i don't know uh the difference between centimeters and meters i just know that there are numbers and that is how much the bed was and of course it was way too big to actually fit in between that space so I decided to actually move my bed over here as long as my bookshelf would also fit and that's me just um contemplating life 
as I always do when I clean my room. <laughs> but yes, I am now cleaning my room and actually, you know, having to make new space because it wouldn't fit. So... <laughs> Alrighty everyone, I think I have basically nearly finished cleaning up my room. I think it was a huge improve, like improvement from literally, did you see my literal room, how it was? It was terrible, terribly messy, but now I think it's definitely a lot better, a lot more me. And someone actually commented on my last video wanting a room tour. Literally, that's so flattering. My room is very interesting. It's just where I live. But um, anyways, let's not get sidetracked. But of course, we're gonna have to do some more vacuuming because again, my carpet is pretty gross and I just need to get all that dust out of there. And then we're gonna actually, look, I actually love obviously a lot of posters in my room. So of course we're gonna have to clean off the blue tack, which I have desperately, you know, tried to get off for ages and just kind of procrastinated. So we're gonna be doing that. Of course, I love posters. Posters are my favorite thing and I've, you know, if you see my room, that's probably very obvious. And of course, wiping down so my books don't go on a dusty surface. Very important. And this is the new place for my books. It looks beautiful. I think it just goes really, really well. But of course, all that's left to do is place them on. I left the keys under the front door and drove it won't be long until I roll up. Please allow me to love you like my last My slumber got disturbed 
A little bit of an update. So this is my room at the moment. I am actually very, very happy with how it turned out. I'm just kind of cleaning up, you know, doing a little bit of little adjustments. But of course, yeah, this is my new room and my room is my room. It is very interesting. It's filled with a lot of different gadgets and I do think it's a very good reflection of who I am, but still it is a little bit confusing to people because it's not all one aesthetic and that's why kind of it's a little bit a little bit disorientating but I still really like it so the last thing to do of course is to put on little you know last touches on my bookshelf because again as I said I really like um just sprucing up my little bookshelf um with my little things around my room that's my um I don't know why I put a light bulb there but it's cool so I like it um, but what you're going to actually see in a very slow moment is I, like literally a week later, I'm not kidding, I actually decided to like kind of reorganize it again. So technically I'm not done. So when I'm smiling right now, I am not actually happy with my bookshelf. I, I liked it. So this is kind of literally like a week later and I just it kind of fell apart I don't really like it so I'm just gonna be taking off all of my my work that I've worked so hard to like kind of make my bookshelf how it is but I just really didn't like it I think it just kind of wasn't really my aesthetic and I decided to do that little trend where people turn around their books and yes I know a lot of people don't like this because of course you can't see the the backs you can't see the actual spines you can't see what books you have on your shelf but i really wanted to try this because i've actually never tried this before and i kind of found out that it really does um you know suit my aesthetic a lot more and i really did enjoy it and here's kitty again she literally is always in my room <laughs> she is so so cute but like what is she doing like what what kitty <laughs> Anyways, so this is a little update, but um, of course I'm just going to be continuing on, you know, switching my books around. Um, all of them, literally, this took a long time, like so much longer than I thought, but I hope you guys just enjoy the aesthetic sort of time lapse um, that is about to come right now. So, enjoy. You know, most times I like to just... Keep it simple. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shit. All right. Let's get it. Ah. Uh. Said, I'ma just live till I'm dead. 
let's go. Alrighty, so this is what it looks like at the moment. Oh, I am so, so happy I decided to do this just as a little final thing and I think it just looks so much better so much more prettier and honestly I don't I know where my books are on my shelf I kind of memorized it so I guess this is kind of how it looks we can just eat and wait for the best but no need to stress and uh once you realize that there's no stopping you from well the best